Hi everybody, this is Suki Readings and hi Scorpio. Let's see what messages will come up for you guys in case this resonates. There will be a link in the description box to the extended to find out how is your person thinking, feeling about you, their next moves, outcome advice, love notes, guidance from spirit and your future love. So do check it out. It will be linked underneath the video for you guys. What do we have for Scorpio? What do we have for Scorpio, please? love and security pleasure at the bottom of the deck for a lot of you even you know when i was pre-shuffling i feel like scorpio there was a lot of focus on love okay and let me tell you something at this time there is a big focus on your relationships on you know um how you're interacting with other people there's like this very empress like vibe about about you if you don't know what that means empress is a card in tarot that represents a beauty it represents growth it represents um the potential of growth okay and it is you know venus energy and that is libra and taurus energy and that is seventh house energy so all of it is very much linked and i do feel like for a lot of you scorpio over the course of the next few months actually there's going to be a big focus on your relationships but what I see for you is that you're a bit secluded or closed off because personally, if I look at you, um, there is a lot that you're hiding within yourself, okay? But there's also, you know, a lot that you have gained over the course of, actually, I'm going to say this year, you have learned a lot of lessons. And I also feel like um, there's like that urge um, that you have to almost like rise above something okay something very adventurous also but there's that urge that you have to rise above some above something okay i don't feel like your focus is on relationships too much um there is like that unpredictable vibe about your relationships so somebody might come in your life very unexpectedly um but this is this is an energy of exploring okay this is an energy of discovering so i do feel like you know that maybe you are into that or maybe it is the other person's energy i'm not sure but when it comes to your relationships i'm seeing unexpected changes um and when it comes to you as a person i feel like your intuition is going to be heightened i also feel like you're exploring yourself as well okay and there is like this energy of hidden something hidden but you know if that makes any sense it's it's almost like you're hiding something within you but you know the direction that you're headed towards okay i do feel like you're a bit secluded or closed off and it has already been almost four minutes and i'm here just like giving you intuitive messages but you know the energies are highly focused on love for this read and personal growth but we'll see look at that first cut out ten of cups happiness expansion family um good time okay a lot of emotional fulfillment in case this resonates do check out your extended Scorpio that will be linked underneath the video if you're interested okay <clears throat> tell me more for Scorpio please give me more messages for Scorpio what is their challenge three of wands reverse Okay. Empress energy. Nine of Wands. Okay. 
Page of Wands. I do see communication coming through. I see somebody coming towards you. Yeah, look at that. Page of Cups and the Five of Cups reverse. A lot of you, I feel like you are trying to let go of a painful situation or something that happened in the past that used to bother you so much. I, I feel like that doesn't bother you anymore, Scorpio. That is good. Okay, and I do see new possibilities or new ventures. Look at that. I also feel like something will be revealed to you over the course of the next few weeks, actually. Somebody might confess something or, you know, somebody's true colors will be revealed to you. So pay attention to the people around you and what they're trying to show you because I feel like something will be revealed with the Eight of Wands and the Seven of Swords reverse. Whoever you're dealing with, Scorpio, their energy is the Emperor, Eight of Cups, and the Nine of Cups. You walked away from this person, or I don't know if they walked away, but it does look like this person is trying to control the urge to reach out to you even though they keep thinking about you. This person, when they look at you, they feel like you're controlling yourself, okay? You are holding back, but I feel like it's not holding back. You've just surrendered. Look at that hermit energy. You've just surrendered. Pisces got a similar advice, so maybe you're dealing with the Pisces. What about the, look at that. What about the deck? We have High Priestess and the Ace of Cups. This is Pisces energy. All right, let's see. Tell me about Scorpio's challenge with the Three of Wands reverse. Five of Pentacles. Lack of patience. I feel like for a lot of you, Scorpio, your challenge over the course of the next few weeks is going to be lack of patience and overspending. <sighs> okay, a lot of you are overspending or there are issues with money. Okay, that I see here. That is showing up in your challenge. Your advice here is to open up to something though. Any advice for Scorpio's challenge tower? I feel like Scorpio, there are endless possibilities. Something might fall apart, but with the Seven of Cups energy, you still have a lot that you can explore. The Sun card wanted to come out. So it, it almost looks like your challenge here is to look beyond what you expect okay because with the sun and the tower energy it's almost like there's a renewal that is attached to something toxic um it's it's almost like an energy of possibility okay nine of wands six of pentacles page of wands four of swords for a lot of you um i'm seeing that There is a focus on money that you have, Page of Wands to the Four of Swords energy. I really feel like Scorpio, somebody is going to be communicating with you. Somebody is going to be opening up to you. But I feel like <laughs> what I see here is that a lot of you are very determined to let go of a past situation. Okay, you're letting go of something from the past. So when this new person or whatever this communication is that is coming towards you, you're opening up to it and then you're closing off as well. Okay? What is the Seven of Swords reverse? Somebody might confess something. Somebody might tell you that they find you very attractive or they want to date you, something like that, because it is, again, attached to the Queen of Wands and the Eight of Wands, which is communication.
Eight of Swords to the Four of Pentacles. Four of Pentacles. Okay, the person that you're dealing with, Scorpio, it looks like you're on their mind, but they are, you know, they're not very vocal about it or they're not really communicating with you, all that. It just looks like they're very silent. <sighs> but I feel like there are other possibilities for you as well, apart from this person that you already dealt with. Because with the Page of Cups, I do see something new. Ten of Cups is your overall. You have the Nine of Cups too, Page of Swords. Even you want this. I feel like for a lot of you, your focus is on letting go, surrendering control. And it's, it's almost like you have surrendered and now you're like, okay, if this is in my fate and destiny, I will get it kind of an energy. So I like it that you have um, decided to surrender control when it comes to a certain situation. Okay. What is the hermit about? Nine of Swords. Communication is coming in. Communication is coming in. So Scorpio, I feel like over the course of the next few days, there will be changes in your life, but I also feel like from time to time, you're going to withdraw and go within. So it's almost looking like you're opening up to the possibilities around you and then you're withdrawing as well. Okay. What is the Two of Swords and the Nine of Cups? Scorpio, um, your advice here. It's almost like you should take chances, but don't make rec reckless decisions. Um, and don't be impatient. Think things through. Give me one more message for Scorpio, anything they need to know. Six of Wands, victory, success, forward movement. I also feel like it's it's almost like you're grabbing a lot of attention, um, Scorpio. Okay. Let's see. Let's read for you love and security. And I will link your extended underneath the video to find out how is your person thinking, feeling about you, their next moves, outcome of ice, love notes guidance from spirit and your future love okay so do check it out it will be linked below love is all around you love is coming into your life you're already more cherished than you can possibly know indeed you are a sacred vessel for love to flow through you and when you stand in the center of it all, all is well no matter what is happening around you you know that you're loved and you're lovable you know that you know that there's nothing that you need to do to deserve love you are enough just as you are the creator is love and in depth of your soul you are love in the matters of the heart and romance all is healing or is already healed in terms of self-love your confidence and self-esteem are growing as you take time to cherish and care for yourself let's read for you security You're safe and protected no matter what is occurring in your life. You're in safe hands. Those in the realm of spirit are watching over you. You can relax and let go. Once you've taken measures to protect yourself and those you love, such as making sure everyone has their seatbelt on in the car, make sure your insurance is paid on time, or, or replacing the filter on your heating unit, then let go. If you have been hyper vigilant lately, take a break, relax, know that all is well, and you can turn it all over to the creator. Thank you so much for being here, Scorpio. Those were the messages that came up for you. I hope that you were open to receive these messages. 
and I hope that you got something out of the reading. I will link your extended underneath the video if you want to know more about what's going to happen between you and your person next. What is the advice from spirit and your bonus messages that I didn't pick up on in this read? So do check it out. It'll be linked below. Take care and bye-bye.